Hello children, now let us move to the next word problem on integers. In a 2 by 50 meters relay race, Priya ran the first 50 meters and handed the baton to Rinki, who instead of running towards the finishing line, ran back 10 meters towards the starting line before she was stopped. How many meters must Rinki run to finish the race? So let us break this uh, sum and understand what they have told. In a 2 by 50 meter relay race, that means there is a race, relay race, okay, where Priya and Rinki are going to run as partners. So let us assume this to be the starting point. And this is to be the finishing point. And this is 2 by 50 relay. So 2 into 50, so 2 into 50 meters means this is a 100 meter stretch children. So they have to run from A to B and finish this 100 meters. Priya ran the first 50 meters. So Priya is starting from here and she is finishing here at B and completing a 50 meter stretch. That means children from A to B, if I take, sorry, this is C. So, if I take A to B as 50 meter, Priya has started from here and she has finished running 50 meter. So, and hands the baton to Rinki. Now, Rinki has to start running from here to here. So, Rinki has to run from B to C. So, how much meter she has to cover children? Out of the 100 meter, Priya has already covered 50, she has ran. So, the remaining 50 meter has to be covered by Rinki. But what she does? Who, instead of running towards the finishing line, she has to run from here, this side, right? Ran back 10 meters towards the starting line. So, she is running back 10 meters. She is running back instead of going towards the finishing point. She is coming from this point to starting point that is 10 meters where before she was stopped. People are telling stop here, you have to run that side. Now, how many meters must Rinki run to finish the race? That means Rinki has to start running from this point. So, let us assume this D. So, from here she has to finish the running race till C. Now, what is the distance between DC? So, let us see. Rinki has to run. Okay. How much? From point D to C. From point D to point C. So, the distance between DC is. What is DC children? DC is DB plus BC. So, how much is db children? From d to b, she ran 10 meters. So, that is 10 meters. Plus bc, what she had to initially run? 50 meter. So, totally 60 meter. So, how many meters must Rinki run? Rinki has to run 60 meters. Finish the race. Now let us see the next sum. Now our next problem is the product of two numbers is 105. If one number is minus 7, what is the other? So what is, what is the meaning of product children? Product means multiplication. So when you are multiplying two numbers, the answer is, is means equal to 105. If one number is minus 7, that means out of these two numbers, one number is given, what is the other? We don't know what is the other. So, let us assume the other number to be x. So, let the other number be x. Now, this is a case of simple linear equation children. We will keep x here as it is in the left hand side. Whatever is before equal to is left hand side and whatever is, whatever is after equal to is right hand side. So x is in the left hand side, keep it here as it is. 105 is in the right hand side, keep here as it is. Now minus 7 when you transpose, 
from left hand side to right hand side multiplication will become division right so x is equal to when you divide 105 by 7 you will get 50 by minus 1 now if you see 1 in the denominator has no value so you can shift this minus sign on top and your answer is x is equal to minus 15 that means our other number is minus 15 hope you understood children see you in our next video bye